So, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this very exclusive webinar on Amesqua Chi Pendant 4. My name is Dr. Shafi. I'm the category manager for Amesqua. And I have with me Dr. Nura, who is helping us also to understand the science behind the product and all this stuff. So before we start this presentation, it's very, very important that last over 18 months or more of this pandemic that we are going through in all parts of the world made us realize one very, very important fact. The priceless commodity for our body, our health, is nothing but immune system. Do you all agree with me? It's very, very, very important that we need to pump up our immune system. So now we are going to understand what are the dangers, what are the invisible dangers that are without even you noticing, but they are present in our environment and they are constantly damaging our overall health and wellness. So let's start with the main root cause. I mean, I can say not exactly root cause, but this is prevailing it's it's increasing year after year okay it is nothing but the environmental pollution whenever i say environmental pollution everybody thinks that bad air or some kind of a pollution in the air i am not talking about the air pollution i am talking about environmental pollution in terms of emfs electromagnetic fields so i i want to ask dr Nero, how what is this wireless thing and why we are mentioning here in this slide, the tobacco of the digital age. Why we are comparing wireless technology with tobacco. All right. Well, um, Dr. Shafi, you understand that um, tobacco, all right, smoking was once a very glamorous lifestyle. All right. It was a glamorous lifestyle and even recommended by doctors for release of stress and to calm a person down. That was what the actual use of tobacco was many, many years ago. All right. And but today in the digital era, wireless technology has become the new addiction like tobacco. That, that is why we refer uh, wireless <laughs> as tobacco of the digital age. And you know what? We are on it 24 seven. We are constantly on uh, wireless connections, wireless technology, 24 hours, seven days a week. All right. So that, that's why. It, this term is, you know, it's kind of cool how they recognize the new wireless revolution as the tobacco of the digital age. All right. And uh, going back to you. So, I mean, we can explain more to understand Absolutely. what is it that we have in our environment today? Absolutely. All right. So, how does, yeah. Yeah. You can actually go to the next slide. So the wireless yeah. technology guys basically consists of two parts. One is man-made. We are solely responsible for these kind of EMF generating either devices or you can say the systems. And the next one is naturally, Earth has atmospheric grid lines, which if it is invaded with EMF of any form, it can uh, literally pose threat to our health. So the man-made EMFs, of course, we all know that TV station satellite feeds, electrical smart meters in our home, the cell phone tower transmissions, local TV station signals, radio station signals, uh, satellites. Now the space in our space station, we have satellites also uh, beaming the waves, okay, which are responsible for many, many like TV channels, or mobile phone networks, satellite networks and everything. And, and Wi-Fi, every house today have more than three or four Wi-Fi routers because you want one in bedroom, one in hall, everywhere, right? The bigger the house, the more routers you need. And uh, of course, we are using our pocket devices like cell phone devices, all smart devices that today we are using, uh, which are wireless. And electrical outlets, you see how these electrical lines are traveling through our homes or next to our homes. They can also cause a huge amount of electromagnetic field. And all, with all these things, man-made frequencies are bombarding, into, uh, are actually exponentially increasing in our environment. On the other side, if you look at our earth grid lines, if they get infected and you are sleeping on top of it, and it happens that the banker, uh, this uh, banker, career, Hartman lines are crossing just below your bed and it is infected with EMFs and you get nightmares, illusions, there's so many things. Just by shifting your bed uh, one or two feet, you will not get that, you know, that kind of thing. So these are 
that much infectious or you can say that they affect your uh, body's energy levels in that level. Yeah. Back to you, Dr. Nura. Yeah. So today, um, you know, let's, let's understand. Let's go back and look at what has actually uh, gone with us. You know, what have we gone through throughout these years? We have gone through a wireless technology milestone. Okay. And all of this have been evolving in the age of information. You know, there are many generations that we go through. All right, right from uh, agricultural uh, revolution, we went into the industrial uh, revolution one and two, and then we came into the scientific uh, revolution. And today we are in something called uh, the age of information. Okay, so if you know, as, as early as 1977, we had the use of personal computers. All right, the introduction of personal computers in 1997. Uh, sorry, 1977. And then we went on, uh, if you look at 1992, that was the first introduction to broadband use. All right, broadband was first introduced in 1992. And then it went on uh, in 1996, from computers, you had cell phones and cell phone towers that came along with it. And then in 1998, all right, uh, that's where the generation, the second generation started, where you had not just cell phones and cell phone towers, you also had low orbit satellites, okay? This was introduced. Um, and then we went on and we understood that 3G, the third generation brought the introduction of Wi-Fi, all right? And that happened in 2001. And then all the way up to 2007, you and I were carrying smartphones, all right? After the introduction of Wi-Fi, then we had the use of smartphones, all right? Today, all of us carry smartphones. And then it came up to 2019, where this um, entire uh, wireless revolution, all right, or we call it the internet of things, started to uh, take place. We entered a revolution called the fifth generation, all right? This has started in 2019, and it's still continuing now. It's not... Um, it's just an introductory phase that happened in 2019. It started off in the US and then Dubai, all right, South Korea. And today it's coming into all our countries, all right? 5G is the new, um, they call it the new infrastructure, all right? The new thing, the internet of everything, all so right? Cool. Back to you, Dr. Shafi. Yeah. So now what is 5G? If you're wondering there, uh, you know, even in Malaysia, we're all getting the messages from, uh, our service uh, network service providers that we are upgrading to 5G very, very soon, you know, all this kind of stuff. So understand, all this while we are using fourth generation of uh, network. That means we have cell phone towers, which are actually installed uh, on our big, big towers in our cities, uh, which are actually like, you know, a miles apart. But this fifth generation wireless communication is entirely different. They are actually so fast. I mean, this technology makes things work so fast that you can download a 10 gigabyte file in just 3.6 seconds against the 4G will take at least six minutes. That is the kind of speed you will get with 5G network. Okay. But how it is possible that you will get such a huge thunderous speed? The next slide will explain that they are going to get rid of all the cell phone towers which are there for 4G and they replace it with small sized antennas and they are placed every 60 meters. Okay, every 60 meters you will find these antennas placed. So obviously if you are living in a uh, township or in a society where currently you may only have like 10 or 12 uh, cell phone towers in a vicinity of say two to two, three kilometers, you will find thousands in near future but they are small, invisible. You can't even notice them because they are not actually big towers, okay? And not only the cell phone towers uh, are these small antennas. The space station currently, uh, uh, you know, every country that is actually, you know, uh, rolling out 5G, they are sending satellites which are 5G enabled. So you are also getting the 5G beams from your space directly to your homes. So you have both ground covered and also from the space you will be bombarded with these 5g frequencies and just to understand 5g frequencies are 100 times 
hundred times more effective uh, in terms of performance and everything. And that's the reason why we are talking about IoT will be moved by fifty billion uh, things. In the next slide, you will actually see that Internet of Things basically means what we use in our hands and you know day to day life, but also it includes our home appliances industrial appliances as well as various uh, sectors like transportation heavy machinery and all this stuff so what we are aware of iot is only the last segment that you see on your uh, uh, right you know bottom corner these are monitors our wearables mobile phones and ipads and all this stuff but what in the future you are going to see is that you can operate with your mobile phone app almost all the appliances in your home whether it's a refrigerator, washing machine, vacuum cleaner, security systems, they're already there, right? In many, many countries, already there. But they're going to improve to a level where your presence is not required. Everything will be monitored by maybe a third-party company or something like that. And your other systems, other, other areas, industries like transportation, heavy machinery, utilities, they are going to be vastly moving to 5G to automate. So literally, we are increasing earth atmospheric emfs with the 5g introduction that is one thing there is a huge amount of radiation or uh, electromagnetic fields are going to increase but other side also you, you need to think we are also introducing a new species yes, called robots to you know coexist with us that means we are going to co uh, coexist on this planet earth alongside of technology or ai or you can say robots or whatever Okay, this it's so good, right? We are hearing so much of this technology going to help us. But what is the downside of it? Let's hear it from Dr. Nura. All right. So, um, thank you, Dr. Shafi. This is so true. And today, um, this is a very important slide for us to understand. We're reflecting on ourselves. We are known to be energy beings. All right. We are we are known to be energy beings, and we are very sensitive to energy that comes from many things, all right? They can, uh, even energy that comes from other living beings, all right, other people, the earth, all right, the sun, and even from modern technology. So we are sensitive to some of these things that are being emitted from modern technology. And how do we know that, all right? How do we know and, and uh, recognize uh, this sensitivity, all right? Now, before I show you the next slide, you see, we need EMF of the earth. We need electromagnetic radiation because it's very, very beneficial to us. But along the way, something has gone wrong, all right? Uh, when we as humans intervened and tried to harness this electromagnetic radiation, we made it so much stronger and we made it a part of the information technology, all right? So in this transformation, we did not take into consideration nature, all right, or all living organisms like us, animals, plants, everything in nature, all right, when we were creating man-made electromagnetic radiation. So if you see what, why, why are we sensitive to this kind of technology, the next slide shows you why, all right. This was an experiment that was done, okay. Uh, if you see the pictures that I'm showing you, this is known as the human biofield. This capture was taken by a very specialized uh, device, a camera. All right. It's able to capture the human biofield. And what it is showing you today is the exposure of the human field to wireless radiation for up to 30 minutes. So if you look on the left, the picture on the left, if you look at the field, this is what you see. Now the picture on the right, after exposure to radiation for 30 minutes, can you see that the biofield has got more distortions, more disturbances around the field? So this shows us, all right, this demonstrates to us visibly that we are sensitive as living organisms to what's happening with technology, all right? And this is just 30 minutes, some people, even in an exposure of 15 minutes are more sensitive, all right? So this shows the dangers of what it does to our field, to our biofield, all right? Now we'll go on to explain to you about electromagnetic fields, okay? 
Uh, Prof. Shafi, would you like to take the slide? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, before that, guys, uh, sorry, I, I will mute everyone uh, because some people are actually uh, muting. So I'm not allowing you to unmute. For a while. Okay. So, Dr. Nray, you can. Okay, guys. So, if you actually look at, uh, Dr. Nara made a very, very important point that artificial, I mean, Earth has also electromagnetic field, right? So, that is what actually you are looking at on your right hand side, okay, where we, the visible light is there, there is an infrared, there is ultraviolet. This is what helpful for our body. And these are all falls in that visible spectrum, okay, which are analog and continuous waves. Whereas when you look at our artificially man-made frequencies, which are wireless technological, you know, EMFs, they fall under radio, radio wave spectrum. And the 4G network falls somewhere between 2 gigahertz. But 5G, just look at 5G, yeah? it is crossing 39 gigahertz. 4G is at between 2 to 5 gigahertz, whereas 5G is almost like six, seven times higher range. And this 39 gigahertz is only the starting point. There are plans to take it up to 90 gigahertz. Okay. So because our, our, our invention can lead us to, you know, uh, different levels. But what it brings to us is something very, very important for you to understand. It brings us a concept called barrel, uh, rain barrel concept. So when there is a rain, when you have uh, rain falling and there are drops, raindrops, you want to collect it and you put a vessel. This would have done it in our childhood, right? The vessel can only accommodate certain amount of raindrops. Once it is full, it overflows. Exactly the same thing with our brain. You can also absorb certain amount of stress. After that, your brain gives up and it can lead to chronic stress and chronic stress manifestations you all know. Okay, the next slide will show all the possible problems of chronic stress. Sleeplessness. Just ask yourself, even today our kids cannot sleep. Like how you slept at 8 p.m. or 9 p.m. You know, during your childhood. Today the kids are awake until 10, 11, 12, sometimes even midnight, cross midnight. We have a problem with sleeplessness. And we have reduced mental and physical performance. You work for four hours straight, you're exhausted. Your, your tiredness is absolutely there. You can feel it. Yeah. And you're fatigued. You're tired very, very fast. You're low resistant to disease. This pandemic had clearly, clearly shown your age is not at all linked to your immune system. Younger people also succumb to COVID. Why? There is a clear problem with our understanding of what is required to boost our immune system. We are absolutely ignored about it. Okay. And mood fluctuations and aging factor, it accelerates aging. When you're highly stressed, you will get wrinkles very fast. You're aging. Your face looks much older than what's your real age. And anxiety, depression, eating disorders, all these things, what you are seeing on your slide are the results of chronic stress. And what is adding a big chunk of these stress factors are coming from what you hold in your hand. Dr. Nora will explain in the next slide. Yes. So today, I mean, I'm going to take you on to see some of the statistics of what's really happening. What is the reality of the world today? Seven billion people and rising are using mobile phones as their main personal communication tools. All right. See, some of us out there don't just have, don't just carry one mobile phone. Some of us carry two mobile phones or three mobile phones uh, with us. And this is basically our main personal communication tool today. And what, what is happening to us because of this? All right, let's go further to understand. Now, this was a study that was conducted by the Environmental Health Trust. Okay, They worked with a team in Brazil uh, to find that the amount of cell phone radiation absorption in the brain. So this is what you're looking at. They developed a new model that showed what happens to a full grown man and a three year old girl. All right, so pay, pay very close attention to this. This is what they found out after both uh, the full grown man and a three year old girl 
was exposed to a six minute conversation on a cell phone. All right. So they, they were exposed to a six minute conversation on a cell phone. And this is what they saw. They saw that cell phone radiation was very much absorbed by both the, uh, the grown man as well as a three year old girl. But they were heavily absorbed or faster absorbed by the three year old girl. All right. So little children exposed to mobile phones absorb more radiation than in a full grown adult like us but both of them do absorb radiation. So today, I want you to reflect of what, what actually has happened during the pandemic of the COVID-19. Have you realized many of us have stayed home and worked, all right? Many of us have stayed home and worked and your children are doing online schooling at home, all right? So they are also constantly exposed to uh, wireless radiation. They are on their laptops, all right. And then even, you know, children after schooling hours, what do you do in order to shut them up? You throw an iPad at them. All right. I've seen children today very absorbed into their iPad, especially watching children's programs like Coco Melon and all of this. They are right into it. So can you imagine the hours and the amount of absorption that is hurting their brains, their brain cells? OK, because of this exposure. All right, so it's important for you to understand. And these are real life studies that have been conducted, all right, to show you, okay? And now in um, 2011, the International Agency for Research on Cancer, all right, uh, they are an agency of the World Health Organization. I'm sure all of you have heard of WHO, the World Health Organization. They went on to classify wireless radiation as group 2b that means possibly carcinogenic which means it can be causing cancer okay so they have actually classified radiation as cancer causing so and this has been done as early as 2011 but today all of us despite all these facts that are there some are hidden some are taken away very quickly from our uh, you know, from us actually going into it and reading more about it. But we have been still ignorant. We are still using all our devices. Yes, it's very important. But the question here today is, how can you live energized? How can you live protected in this wireless world? All right. That means as much as you enjoy technology that you need, how can you still safely protect yourself? Now for that, Dr. Shafi, would you like to continue? Absolutely, guys. So if you want to answer this question, how to live energized in this wireless world, is it possible for you to even escape, okay? Leave everything wherever you are right now and even go to a jungle, hide there, still the 5G will follow you because the 5G is going to, uh, going to be made available even when you are in the middle of the ocean. That means you are yeah. actually in the middle of the ocean and you still can get, uh, you know, network that means we are talking about there is no place to escape so you have to live here but how you can protect it that is where amesqua is playing a very very important role and we bought the best product that can help you to boost your biofield and also to protect your body against the dangers of emf that product is nothing but amesqua cheap and in four before we go into the product let's watch the teaser and then we will explain you what this product is made of.
what is this chi pendant for okay and how it is different from the previous versions let us first understand the chi pendant for it is a wearable technology which you can wear around your neck like how how i am wearing right now and this works with your brain innate intelligence understand that who is the best doctor for you if you want to answer this question the best doctor for you is your own body not the doctor that you know not the doctor that actually did surgery on you the best doctor for you it's your own body it has got the in the, there is something called innate intelligence all it requires is the ingredients for it to you know use it and also correct it so this pendant has all those ingredients okay which are required by your brain in order to function optimally and reduce stress protect your body from the environmental attacks and so many things so this chi pendant 4 the main features it has got a a chip inside that is powered by art very easy to spell art right art stands for amesqua resonance technology the previous three versions we had technologies which are actually like kind of a borrowed from the scientific community whereas the chi pendant 4 we have our very own technology it belongs to qnet so art belongs to qnet amesqua resonance technology we will understand more what is this technology how does it work in the next slides but it it uses this art technology harnesses the subtle energies which are very very important for our body to boost its energy levels okay and also if you look at chi pendant 4 there are unique designs on top of it you can see one big octagon in the copper color and there is a flower of life design the design in the center on the aerospace aluminum part it is it has got a unique function in our life so this octagon and the flower of life has got additional function to our balancing uh, you know uh, various things in our life now the life span of one chi pendant 4 is 30 long years it is something unbelievable right the previous versions are 15 years the chi pendant 3 was 25 years now we got chi pendant 4 which can last up to 30 years and you can wear it throughout 24 bar 7 there is no restriction that male female pregnant woman anybody can wear it there is no restriction kids about 3 years up to 12 years you can actually you know give it uh, four to six hours a day so to understand more about technology let us first start with art what is this art technology back to you dr nara you can explain art all right um something again i would like you to you know play pay very close attention to and listen uh the amesqua resonance technology as dr shafi shared this is the uh, first that we have introduced qnet's very own proprietary technology and we call it art now it says that it's based on a law of resonance now what do we understand by resonance okay all objects they interact with the energy of the universe all right that that means the energy of nature to produce certain energy field around them just like us all right we interact with nature and we have a biofield all right uh, animals have a biofield plants have a biofield so when two energy fields are close to each other and they communicate and modify each other all right like our biofield is constantly interacting with the environment okay now this is what we call uh, all of this are actually happening to the through the law of resonance okay and that's the very basis okay that art technology was based on for this energy interaction okay now art is qnet's proprietary process okay they're programmed to resonate with uh, and support your body's own energetic system okay they are designed to work with your body and for your body so they work with and they work for all right so what does uh, how is art put into the amesqua chi pendant 4 now basically inside the chi pendant 4 we have something called an activated wafer now in simple terms the wafer means a chip all right it has a little round chip just as how you're seeing the picture on the slide okay and this chip has been exposed to a powerful subtle energy field what do you mean by subtle energy a very very 
low emitting energy field all right a low emitting energy field which is very powerful all right and this process which takes over a specific period of time all right it goes through it for a specific period of time converts or transforms this chip into an effective energy transmitter okay so now this chip when it's being put in uh, exposed to this powerful field over a certain period of time it now becomes a energy transmitter which means it can now effectively harness all right it can make uh, subtle energies and it can also transfer subtle energies all right so this is basically what the chip does and um, how does it interact uh, basically uh, it reinforces your body's own similar energies which uh, dr shafi shared it's your innate intelligence all right it improves your overall well-being it makes us more resilient to stress all right and we become more resistant to any form of disease basically our biofield becomes stronger more balanced and it protects us from any form of um you know um uh, frequencies harmful frequencies around in our environment so that is what uh art technology uh in the chi pendant does to us all right i can see that you know many people are very actively drawing on our screen you can you can block the annotation <laughs> yeah That's, yeah fantastic okay and going on uh again as what we shared in the earlier slide the chi pendant for not only comes with a chip called uh which is processed using art technology it is also designed with specific angular relationships all right and geometrical ratios to produce an energy balancing field in the central area inside the shape okay so what do you see here you have the flower of life now the flower of life adds uh, a specific function which is it harmonizes and enhances positivity all right so it's it's basically working with the brain waves all right in your brain and then you have the octagon why do we call it specific angular relationship because this is a perfect 135 degree octagon all right it's a perfect 135 degree octagon and its main benefit is to strengthen the biofield all right so these are the added functions from the geometry of shapes in the chi pendant four and this is what makes the amesqua chi pendant four very very uh, state of the art very protected i mean it's able to protect us all right and we call this today the most wearable uh, protective tech all right the technology that protects your biofield now moving on from here we're going to share with you uh, some of the main benefits that you will gain from using the amesqua chi pendant four all right Absolutely. so yeah so I'll Shaki, it, you share yes, with them absolutely fine so guys understand that your brain responds to sounds or frequencies like how dr nara explained about the subtle energies and all imagine you uh, you know uh, interacting with the other kind of frequency that are present in our environment okay what if you are hearing the sounds uh, like say for example next to your home there is a construction happening there are there a lot of drilling happening into the ground and there are a lot big machinery is being at uh, you know at work listening to these kind of big noises or these kind of proclaimer sounds you get definitely headache you will have irritation you you are, you cannot feel comfortable right but what if you imagine yourself at a at a place whether it can be a rainforest or whether it can be a, a nature spot like a, maybe a beach and you are lying down there you are relaxing there and you are still listening to the sounds or waves or some kind of frequencies but they are in the nature okay and those sounds make you feel rejuvenated that's why music makes you rejuvenated right you are listening to uh, you know soft kind of thing or subtle energies make you feel resonated okay that is what actually we are talking about here the chi pendant 4 it is it has got, it is having a chip which delivers those subtle energies so the benefits are very clearly stated here it boosts your energy levels it rebalances your overall biofield very important the moment your biofield is distracted or damaged 
you can fall sick very very fast that is your first line of defense your energy field your biofield is the first line of defense if you if your biofield is compromised anything can invade your body that's why you fall sick very fast even a young uh, you know a kid also a person also can get fall uh, you know uh, to a virus uh, to a virus or any kind of infection and it can damage the body you know uh, drastically and and if you look at the cheap and four it improves your physical performance now how many of you actually like uh, physically active doing exercises or walking swimming or various kind of activities right when you wear the cheap and four and you do your say treadmill you are able to do treadmill say 15 minutes with certain speed and you have certain level of energy that you spent right wearing a cheap and four and also drinking biodisc energized water okay these two are very they they uh, 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 help each other also because your body need to detox and energy flows very very fast with the cheap and four so when you wear the cheap and four and you do the same activity the next time after 15 minutes you still have more energy to spend you will have another 10 minutes to go that is what we are talking about improving your physical performance in our body the energy is hidden in uh, in the peripheral parts like arms and legs that energy which is hidden also comes into action and when you wear it and sleep you get very good sleep it promotes sleep understand your brain have five different frequencies one of the frequency called delta frequency very important for it to be active when you are sleeping okay and when you're traveling by aeroplanes or you know these pressurized compartments people usually get jet lag and the best way to deal with this jet lag is by wearing this pendant you will not have jet lag you can ask dr nara we traveled so many hours in the flight like 16 hours flight right after the you know landing we can directly go on stage and we can talk for next 6 hours 4 hours okay yes. there is no jet lag experience at all when you are having this cheap and four and one more interesting thing is that you wear this pendant outside right so when you are traveling especially in the aeroplane and all definitely people will notice hey what you are wearing because you wear it usually outside i encourage everybody to wear it outside it is a fantastic prospecting tool everybody who look at it they will ask hey it looks different what is this you already created interest you say that sorry i, I take care of my health you know Uh, my health is very very important to me and this is a wellness tool you want to know more about it we can spend a coffee you know something like that then you know what to do right yeah and uh, the rest of the benefits it boosts your immune system it promotes brain wave coherence like imagine in a football team you need a goalkeeper a defender a mid, you know a midfield and and the strikers everybody is very very important in your brain is also there are five different frequencies and all these five frequencies they need to work in tandem they work as a team and that coherence you will achieve with the cheap and four when you wear the cheap and four your brain will start adjusting the frequencies emissions and you will achieve that optimal balance and dr nara very clearly explained about the geometrical designs and its benefit that is what is the last but not the benefit and the last one is positivity and creativity okay nowadays uh you know many 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 people because of stress they go into depression and they get this suicidal tendencies they have lot of you know uh, negative thinking whereas wearing a chi pendant can activate the brain part in your uh, especially in your brain the part which deals with creativity and positivity that obviously if your intent is very clear that you want to grow you want to be positive it will help immensely Okay, so cheap and yeah. four guys have got all these benefits. Now, just adding on to what Dr. Shafi has shared, a very important point, especially today during the pandemic of the COVID nineteen, where the part we say that the bed one of the benefits is to increase immunity. See, we wear the cheap pendant over the heart. All right, uh, the heart meridian is uh, where you actually wear the cheap pendant. Uh, it's basically to strengthen and balance your biofield. but our heart region is also where uh, there is the thymus gland all right and you know that the thymus gland is responsible for immunity all right it's very responsible is the main organ of the immune system so imagine why when we wear it over the uh, heart meridian it's very close to the thymus gland and therefore it promotes immunity it protects the thymus gland all right so this is really very important Uh, to why and why we accelerated 
the introduction of the Qi Pendant for during this pandemic. It's basically to help you to boost your immune system, all right, to become a protective tool during this pandemic. And, and that's one of the most important things that uh, why Amesqua Qi Pendant 4 was launched. Now we're going on uh, to talk about the application. What are the do's and don'ts of using the uh, Qi Pendant 4? Basically, the do's are everything that you, you know, as you see from the time that you wake up, uh, you can just wear it on. Today, if you're working from home, it's important that you wear it on while you're working and exposed to your computers, uh, or even if you're going out, if you're traveling, uh, even for children while they're doing online school, they can wear on the cheap and four. Uh, if you're doing some gym activities, uh, you know, sports, uh, whatever that you're participating in, you can constantly use the cheap and four. Now, what are the don'ts with this and why we emphasize, especially now with the Amesqua cheap and four, please do not use it when you take a shower or when you're going for a swim in a swimming pool. Now, the reasons for this is because, um, you know, water, uh, the quality of water differs in many countries, all right? They also contain a lot of hard substances, plus water can be, they call it hard water or soft water, and it has contaminants in it, okay? So it is important that you do not use it during this time because it may uh, damage the surface, the physical appearance of your pendants. All right, and especially if you're in different temperature waters, all right, uh, very hot water can also expand the metal and then it may cause uh, a physical uh, distortion to the appearance of the pendant. And um, how do you actually take care of the cheap pendant for very simple use a cloth, uh, a slightly damp cloth and all you need to do is wipe the pendant with the damp cloth. All right, that's all. That's how easy it is. Uh, to take care of the uh, cheap and then fall. Okay, going on. Um, yeah, Amesqua, yeah. I mean, as we, we spend a lot of uh, uh, time and uh, also money in conducting safety and efficacy testings. Now, the reasons for why we conduct efficacy testings is to prove all that we have claimed in our benefits, how the products work on us. All right, how, how do we interact with this product? How does it give us those benefits? And the safety testings are to ensure that there is no further, all right, uh, radionucleotides or anything in the ingredients that are used to produce this uh, product. All right, and Dr. Shafi, you can continue to share on this. Absolutely, absolutely. Guys, there is a, a recent study that came out from Bayan Institute in Slovenia. We will be updating everyone during VCC about that. A remarkable study on the cheap and four. Please wait another one or two weeks, maximum 10 days. We will reveal it, the study reports and everything on the cheap and four. It will be mind blowing. Okay. Now coming to very, very important disclaimer that our product is not intended to treat or diagnose. Understand that we are in the area of wellness. We are not here as doctors to, to treat you with medication, treat you with so, you know various things. No, we are here to give you a product that works with your own body energy levels and it is more of like a prevention. So if you believe in prevention better than going for treatments and cure, you are in a right place. That is why our closing statement for today's session, if you believe that prevention is better than cure, empower yourself with cheap and four. And also look out for other Amesqua products, Biodisc 3 to structurize the water. You have Biolite 3 to help with your pain. A lot of, lot of things that it can add a value in your life. And don't forget to take your edge as well because it is internally you need the glutathione, bio water, then cheap and four. It will be a fantastic uh, combination of products that we are going to you know, help to push our immune system up and running. With that, thank you very much. We have finished our theory part and we can open the floor for a few questions. We can take a five or six questions because of the time factor that we have. Uh, yeah. So those yeah. who want to ask questions, you can actually raise your hand and then we'll take questions in order. Yeah, you can raise your hand and we'll unmute you accordingly. So I think we have our first question from uh, Samat Savat Rajab. Um, okay, I'm, I'm actually asking you to unmute.
Hi. Hi. Yeah. Uh, thank you for giving us such a wonderful uh, chance to ask some questions. Actually, sure. I have some doubts about uh, which material do you have used uh, making chipendent? Which materials? Like, uh, uh, did you use any magnet system on this chipendent? No, the entire uh, Amesqua cheap and for basically the outer thing is made from stainless steel, surgical grade. And uh, then we have an element of the wafer, which is inside the chip. Uh, it comes with special uh, copper and also uh, <clears throat> stainless brass, steel. Brass. Brass yeah, great. Yeah. Okay. So and, uh, okay. And I have some doubts about the... Uh, uh, which which material on the chain? We have some chains now. Actually, I'm using this chip and then, uh, Which material we, we have used on the chain? Is it also it's stainless steel? Stainless steel, yes. yes. Stainless steel, yes. 516, if I'm not mistaken. 316. Uh, stain, uh, stainless steel, 316. Uh, Surgical. But, yeah. Uh, understand, guys, very important thing is that the, the chain that we are providing along with chip and then, whether it's chip and then 3 or chip and then 4, it is okay. a complementary uh, from QNET. It's just an accessory. Yeah, yes. it's just an accessory. Okay. Uh, the main mechanism is independent. Uh, okay. uh, for example, for example, if you like to wear in gold, go ahead and wear it in your gold chain or uh, any chain that you have, that you are. There is no restriction as such. No. You can wear it in any of the material that you like. Okay. okay. Thank you. And. Uh... Uh, some doubts uh, in Indian portal. We don't have any options to buy uh, cheap and end. We have another countries. We are, we are choosing now another countries like uh, Qatar, UAE, such, such kind of stuff. This is the countries them. we are using. But yes, uh, yes, at yes. present, we don't have any facility to buy cheap and end from Indian portal. Can we have any option to buy? We are, we are, we are, we heard yes. you uh, for the last couple of years and we have done a lot of groundwork. Uh, very soon you will hear the good news. Okay. You can okay, just hold yes, some more. Yeah. There is yeah, a yeah. slight delay because of COVID. Uh, yeah. Samad, I understand. Yeah. Uh, the COVID literally delayed a lot of things. Okay. And uh, and uh, can I ask uh, one question for? I think we give the option to other other people also. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> no okay. Worries. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you for the yeah. Yeah. chance. Thanks, Samad. All right. Thank so you. the the next person, Techno LC. I mean, that's what we have. US. You can unmute yourself, Techno. Yeah. Yeah, Dr. Nara, you can stop the presentation so that uh, the screen will be wider for everyone. Sure. Yeah, thank you very much for having me. Uh, my name is James Ujera um, from Hi, James. the country called Uganda. Uganda. Oh. Uh, thanks Hi. for a very Welcome. amazing presentation. Now, my question is just very simple. Uh, from various studies, especially particularly from the African perspective, we know that wellness of a human being is related to the mind, body, and soul. You know, there is that symbiotic relationship. Now, this device that you are bringing in, does it have any connection to the soul in a way that it influences it in a positive way? Thank you. Dr. Narak, take it. Uh, sorry. I'm yeah, you can just close, uh, yeah, you can just close okay. the share screen completely. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. Okay, stop share. All right. Okay, uh, Techno, um, about your question. Uh, <clears throat> sorry, uh, James, are you able to just go ahead and repeat your question? James? Yeah, I think uh, James, you're there. You can actually repeat your question one more time. Oh. Hi, James. Oh, sorry. Uh, I, I was trying to unmute and I could not unmute. No, thank no, you. No. I'm saying yeah. that we know that there is always a symbiotic relationship between mm -hmm. man, nature, and an irrevocable linkage to the spirit world. Now, if uh -huh. that symbiotic relation is maintained, then wellness of the human being is maintained at all times. Uh -huh. Now, uh, my question was that... Uh, this amazing device that you have, does it have any connotation to the soul, to the spirit world that maintains this symbiotic relationship? All right, uh, James, this, the, the chief okay. pendant four has no relationship to the spiritual world. Although we say that it keeps a balance between the body, mind and spirit, but 
It's got nothing to do uh, with any connection to the spiritual world. All right. It's something that you wear on. Uh, it takes on the life force energy. It interacts with the life force energy from the universe and it interacts with the human biofuel to create the, <clears throat> to create the resonance that is needed for us to protect our biofield and to balance the biofield. But it has nothing to do uh, with any interconnection to the spiritual world. And all right? that's the and reason none why... Of Amesqua, yeah. None of Amesqua all... products that are energy-based has got anything to do with any spiritual enhancing or spiritual uh, connection at all. All and right, they're just wellness yeah. tools. Yeah, go ahead, Dr. Just Dr. to add on uh, to Dr. Nga's uh, reply, that's the reason why, guys, we have done a lot of scientific clinical studies to back it up with the claims. It is not just only like, for example, if you take our Amesqua Biodis 3, we have now four amazing scientific studies which are published. Okay. So you cannot, somebody simply cannot come and say that, yeah, it does, it does give you miraculous benefits, but I think it is something to do with spiritual. And then suddenly they say black magic or something. So we don't want our product, which is very, very scientifically backed up to put it into a category where you connect with spirit, spiritual and all this stuff. Okay. It has got pure science and we are using the technology of frequencies, uh, resonance and everything. Okay. And our clinical right. studies are also uh, uh, proving the claims that we are actually, you know, like sharing in our trainings. Okay. So keep right. it to science uh, have... purely. Yeah. We have a question from El Haji Mansur. Can we wear the pendant under the shirt? Yes, basically you can wear the pendant over the shirt or you can wear the pendant within. All right, <clears throat> it has no problem. As long as it's sitting on your heart meridian, uh, the pendant functions uh, to protect the entire biofield and to balance the biofield. All right, so no problem wearing it over your clothes or just barely on your chest itself. And as I mentioned, guys, remember when you wear it outside, what's going to happen? You're attracting a lot of prospects. And it's true. If you are, it's if fashionable. You are, it's, it's fashionable and everybody asks. Even yeah, I go out, uh, you know, from uh, the passenger next to you in your flight to, you know, in a, in a supermarket, everybody's eyes will be first thing, look at your face and then next what you're wearing. Yeah, it's time. true, Dr. Shafi, because recently I was traveling. I was away in the U.S., and I was just wearing the pendant and I had strange people asking me, hey, <laughs> yes. is that a special pendant? I said, yes. All right. And, you know, it just invites you yes. uh, to, start a conversation. to speak to people. Yes, Very to start true. a conversation. And especially today, uh, during the pandemic, people are watchful over what you wear and what you use with you on you to see whether that helps, uh, you know, curbing with this, uh, whatever that's happening with this coronavirus and things like that. So it gives you a good opportunity to speak about immunity. All right. Okay. So I encourage you to just wear it and be fashionable about it. And guys, we have a lot of stories from various countries like Indonesia, Malaysia, even in India. I know a few people who used Biodisc water, cheap and then even the older version also. They used it and they got fantastic results uh, from all these kind of uh, issues, whether it's COVID, early stage, you know, uh, like all these testimonies are, are real. People are getting benefited uh, uh, out of our products. It's all that you need to use it religiously. One thing is that you cannot simply buy and put it in a cupboard and expect results. It, is, it will never happen. You need to, yeah. you must use it on a daily basis because these products now, are meant to be used. We have a question, Dr. Shafi, yeah. uh, from Midfall Roshan about whether we can wear the chi pendant for when we are sleeping, all right? So, uh, Mitfal, definitely you can wear the chi pendant for when you're sleeping, all right? It, this is how we actually uh, share about this particular question. Now, basically, throughout the day, you're using the chi pendant for, and uh, if you do not have any trauma or you don't suffer from any uh, kinds of, um, any issues that you have particularly, we encourage you to wear it throughout the day and then at night, if you're uncomfortable, you can always remove it and then wear it again during the day. But if someone suffers from some kind of trauma, all right, or a post-accident uh, condition or something, and uh, or maybe they have a stroke and they have a, prob a problem sleeping at night, then you can wear it throughout the night as well when you sleep. There's no problem, okay? And you realize that you'll sleep even much better. 
But for normal people, sometimes when they wear it at night to sleep, they're unable to sleep. Some people are very highly energetic. All right. So if you don't want to use it at night to sleep, if you are, you know, feeling normal, then you can always take it out during that time. All right. So yes, it can be used throughout. No problem. Uh, we have another question, Dr. Shafi. Uh, okay. No, that's all. I think the other one was whether they can switch on yes. the cameras. So they can <laughs> Actually, we okay, can do, so, we can switch on our cameras and we take a selfie and we keep it, yeah? <laughs> like we can share in our chat groups with everyone. All right, we yeah. have one more question, I think from Maria Juanda. Uh, hold on, let me unmute Maria. Hi, Maria, you can unmute yourself. Yes, thanks, uh, Dr. Anura and Dr. Shafi. Can we yeah. get the article of the clinical trial for uh, cheap and three or four? Cheap and four, Sorry. we will be releasing during VCC. So please hold After on that. to it. But for BioDis3, we already have it on our social media platforms we have. Uh, you just can go to Instagram or Facebook and actually you can uh, go back to our initial uh, uh, post like last year, August. Or uh, before that, you can actually find uh, okay. our articles, links yeah. and everything. But cheap and four will be after we con and yeah. yeah, and then you can you can actually download them. I mean you are you are actually a lucky bunch of people that we shared that we already completed the study and the results are you know uh, unbelievable. Phenomenal. Yes, absolutely. So any more questions guys? You can actually raise your hand and you can actually directly ask to us. And uh, even if you have yeah please please I can see somebody from is it Ghana Abraham? Yeah, we can you can just unmute. Yeah, please unmute and ask your question. Yeah. I think there's a group they want to take a picture, I think. <laughs> <laughs> it's so nice to see a group of people from Africa actually, you know, uh, yeah. attending the session. That's fantastic. All right. I think we don't have any more questions. Yeah. Guys, uh, for all of those uh, from India, we are, we, are, we are very soon, we are coming to you. Uh, These products, you know, we are trying, trying whatever possible things, you know, required in order to get it, you know, made available in India. Thank you very much. Yeah. And uh, this uh, session recording will be shared with your uplines. So you can actually reach out to them if you want a okay. copy of it. Okay. Uh, we have a question. I think one yeah, last Anusha. question we'll take from Okay, Anusha. this is our last question, Mr. Ms. Anusha. You can unmute and you can yeah, ask. Yeah, Ms. Anusha, you can unmute. Hi, uh, I've got a small question. Um, now, say if a child is dyslexic or uh, having uh, short-term memory issues, uh, inability to learn, could this uh, key pendant actually help enhance or uh, accentuate her brain growth or um, because you know as you were saying it works with the five frequencies in the brain could this help very true it it does help with adhd cerebral palsy attention uh, adhd is attention disorder right uh, but the best uh, but the best age group if you ask me below nine years understand that our brain especially for children it grows uh, you know, uh, systematically you know, organized way up to nine years. After that, the brain development deteriorates. That means it gets stagnated kind of stuff. Okay. So the best time period for any kind of, uh, uh, you know, this mentally challenged, uh, just developmental challenges or anything. Best time is below nine years. Use biodisc water, use bio light shining on a certain parts of the brain and body and cheap and four. Cheap and four, four to six hours a day is very, very good for kids, not more than four to six hours. Yeah. No need to give 24 hours like how we can wear it. For kids, four to six hours during their, uh, you know, for example, if they are actually going for occupational therapy or physiotherapy or any kind of activity, physical activity, let them wear it and their uh, concentration levels will be very high. Yeah. It balances their biofield and it works directly uh, with the brain waves to bring a coherence and uh, this is very useful, especially for special kids. And also there is another, another thing that you can use it with BioDisc. When we do a BioDisc webinar, we will also share it. Uh, BioDisc water, you can actually energize it. And that water, you can convert into steam, whether it's a cold steam or hot steam. And 
that where kid is actually playing you can put that steamer in one corner let the biodist water vapor goes into that area and let the kid breathe that air it also helps with oxygenation of brain it improves the oxygen levels in your brain tissues that is something that you can hydrate the brain okay so there are so many ways there are so many things that you can do with our products that's why our products are very unique it is not like one supplement and all you can you can experiment you can do so many different methods okay guys uh, thank you very much for all your time and thank you dr nira for also helping us understand about the technology no. and everyone uh, we are also going to do a couple of webinars on other products uh, okay just before week on so stay tuned for next week tuesday we are going to do one more similar kind of zoom session but with other amesqua range of products okay yes. hope you enjoyed this session and uh, from myself and dr nara thank you very much thank you very much yeah and, and, and we would like to see you at vcc thank you right thank you and this webinar will be ending in 5 seconds thank you